my gosh, you act like I've never played this game before. But I have. In the past. Okay, now we can start. Hey. See, you always put me... I'm, I'm always on edge whenever we record now, because I'm always making yeah. jokes, and then you'll start an episode, and I just won't know. Yeah, well, guess what? I already told you that we started, so there is no excuse this time. God damn it, download times. Okay. <laughs> so, hey, this is a game people home. stopped caring about. <laughs> Are we playing again? I forgot. I don't know. I put in For Honor because I was like, shit, what game do we need to play that will have engaging visuals? Me getting angry because that's good content and good things to just turn the brain off to. Wait, For Honor? Yeah. Isn't, isn't, didn't Jack play like a shit ton of For Honor? Yes. And then I, I may have bought it out of peer pressure. Peer pressure? What console do you have for? No, I had 60 the PS4, and then I was like, God, I love night stuff. I, um, I peer pressured myself into purchasing an okay. Assassin's Creed game. Sorry about that, audience. Uh, I put your mic too close to the phone, so it was, like, going into the red. I think I fixed it now, though, so I think we're all set. Yay. Um, what was it? Okay, yes, I saw the intro. Sorry. I just want to say, I, um, I peer pressured myself into buying an Assassin's Creed game for the first time in, like, five years or something. I... Not five years, it definitely was, like, seven. Uh, I bought Syndicate because I was curious about it, and I was like, this looks alright, and it was... Not too expensive. Yeah. My friends and I had a lot of spree days where we just kind of bought multiplayer games because we bought Uno and then we got bored of it. And then we tried like Dead by Daylight and then we realized that game was bullshit. <laughs> Dude. You know the card game? Yeah. I love that fucking. Why, um, why do we need do a I, Ubisoft account to play it, though? That's stupid. You shouldn't have to have that for a fucking card game. Yes, I don't care about- Oh, that's Battle Pass. Okay. New Armors and whatever. Fuck it. Multiplayer. Let's go. Yeah. I don't um, even know what's happening. Uh, shit. Breach is always fun, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I... Oh my gosh, you act like I've never played this game before. But I have... In the past... Kevin has indeed played video games at one point in his life. I mean, gosh, I basically, like... I only play so many... That was a voice crack in a nutshell, but I generally play RPGs, and while they're great and fun to do, they are uh, not necessarily fun to watch when you're grinding for hours. RPG stands for Robert's Playing Games. Right, Kevin? No. <laughs> <laughs> what? Just... No, because that could be multiple Roberts, like Robert Downey Jr. and Robert Dangerfield. What, who? I don't know. I was thinking about another Robert. You mean Rodney Dangerfield? I think he's dead, too, so it doesn't make sense. That has nothing to do with it. You got his name wrong. <laughs> uh, look, I was desperate for, desperate for another Robert to make a Roberts joke. Robert Duvall. Yep. Uh, oh, what's his name? Robert. No, that's Roger Corman. Um, I don't know. Have you ever but, Googled your own name? Yes, I have. Why is mine like some bald business guy? <laughs> because, I don't know. Uh, I was going to say his name's generic, but that's kind of neat, but... Well, thank you. It's nice to know that I have a generic name. So generic, SNL used it for 
the character for a one-off character. Wait, are we talking about the Kevin Roberts? <laughs> the Kevin Roberts, played by Larry David. Oh God, fuck Your it. Shining moment in college. Looks like I'm gonna be Viking guy today. Speaking of Vikings and Assassin's Creed, uh, Assassin's Creed Valhalla is a thing now. Oh yeah, right. Like, they were like the Odyssey. You know what? We haven't killed any Norse gods, and Kratos is taking his damn time. <laughs> <laughs> Do you kill gods in Assassin's Creed games? I think you kill... I mean, you kill mythological creatures in Odyssey. Spoiler alert. I, I, I didn't play Odyssey. I, I didn't really watch I didn't get to that part. I kind of just played other games because they were more interesting. <laughs> Oh, boy. At some point, like, you play a lot of stealth games, and you're like, stealth is worthless in this stealth game, and I'm mad. That's why I'm going back to, like, Assassin's, to an Assassin's Creed game that could be a good stealth game, but yep. I also have no idea. Oh, okay, yep. So, it looks like I got three of the most annoying people, and uh, a bot, so I got two people that are Orochis, and they're fast and quick, but have little damage, but every noob uses Orochi. And then we have the Viking, who is a noob, and then we have someone who has the DLC. <laughs> oh, I love when they have DLC. Oh, yeah. But I'm just gonna look at the levels real quick. Let's see here. Is it DLC? Let's see here. It's 16... Zero star, zero star, 26, 16, zero 18. Star. Yep. It doesn't really measure skill, but, uh, yeah. Apparently I'm the only one with three coral reefs, whatever that means. <laughs> oh, okay. Why did I say coral reefs? It's just a reef. Is that even what they call those little, like, Olympic leaf crowns? <laughs> it's like, it's like calling it quesadilla and cheese quesadilla mm -hmm. it's just really redundant yeah it's like an olive branch reef really okay so i'm on the attack okay so i'm playing breach mode for those people who have no clue what breach mode is and uh my goal is to take down the gate and kill people while the others have to defend themselves and they have limited amount of lives while we have unlimited amount of lives sup motherfucker oh i oh. think that's a computer player I uh, forgot how to play to, this game. Oh god. I just wanted want to say, uh, Will made a comeback on YouTube and he uploaded uh, his first YouTube hoop in like... I don't know. Oh, like, nice. Yeah, it's really, it's good. I like it. It's very funny. Okay, I f think I found the attack button. Well, shit. I forgot how to play this game. <laughs> oh shit, that's not, that's not a friendly. That is not a friendly. Oh god. Shit. Hey Kevin, how long has this episode been going for? Uh, honestly it's been eight minutes, but most of it was menus. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Look, when you're playing a game that's online only, pretty much, unless you want to go through the story mode, which nobody does, really. Oh look, is that a friend? Nope, it's a computer player. I don't want to have an existential crisis on my own show, thank you very much. Oh cool, who's hitting me? Why is he hitting me? Friend! Why did you hit me? Why you attack when I got your back? <laughs> Gotta protect the neck, Kevin. Um. Running around... Just give me a moment while I run around at the speed of sound. I got places to go. Gotta follow my rainbow. Kevin's gotta follow the road of the LGBT community. Yes. Of course. It's a road that everybody travels at some point. Well, at least questions traveling it. You don't have to travel the whole way, but... At some point, you gotta at least be like... Possibly? I think... I don't think that's offensive to say. <laughs> no, no, some people are, some people think about it. 
and just decide not to go down that road because it's not right for them. Yeah. And that's, that's totally okay. cool. And I got impaled. Awesome. Hey, friend. Um, I just want to say I won't name names because it's not cool to do that. Yep. I, 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 I had a friend who I was under the assumption was bisexual for many years. Um, I visited their island on Animal Crossing. And they had a lesbian pride flag, and I never felt more proud of someone in my entire life. That's nice. <sighs> I'm just holding in my inner rage because uh, what noobs really love to do in this game is shove you off a cliff. And uh, if you're a good player, you can avoid it, but <laughs> lo and behold... Did my actually my friend actually broke the harsh truth about tournaments, so What's we that? can't just go up to a tournament and challenge Mewtwo King. <laughs> Unfortunately, um. Oh no. Yeah, uh, you gotta go through something called a prerequisite or something, which makes a lot of sense actually. Wait, have to go through an actual tournament bracket. Yeah, yeah like. Like an, like an actual fucking tournament. Something like that, yeah. What, you can't spar with Mewtwo King for funsies? I mean, I do not think so. Ah, oh, gosh, I rolled over my friend instead of reviving him. Oh, hey, friend. Oh. Mm. Oh, God, what's the dodge button? Um, what is the dodge button? Kevin? I don't know. I'm just garbage at this game because it's been literally like so a year since I've played this game. So I don't remember anything. I've just learned the difference between a light attack and a heavy attack. <laughs> Maybe I should have gone through the tutorial. Like, we're probably just going to play this round and then call it an episode. Aaron Hansen, is that you? Yes. I guess. I don't know. What's the political fuck. commentary? Fuck the tutorial. Two minutes into the game. What the fuck do I do? T fuck the tutorial? Hey friend. Get hey, the friend. fuck back here. You're dead. Yeah. You're mine now. Alright, uh, where are we on time? Uh, we are 12 minutes in. But right. to say, like, cutting it would be hard. Yeah, let's just cut here, and then we will see you guys in the next episode of Cruel. Cool. You guys like this partway match? Will we win? Will we lose? You lost then, yeah. No, we're literally not even at the gate yet. <laughs> and it's been like six minutes. Well. Oh, then. god damn it. Yeah, so let's find out uh, in the next episode. Stay tuned, folks. Oh no, I think this person knows how to dodge. Ah, shit. Did you, uh, did you hit the off? Why is this person retreating? I have one health out. I just... That's a way to end it, actually, just with an execution. I'm sorry. I'm kind of in the middle of a live game. I'll hit the pause button now. <laughs>